there, Rider Flex Nation. Steve Urban here with more career advice and job interviewing tips for you. And as a quick reminder, if you enjoy our podcast, please remember to subscribe to our channel and like the episodes. And on today's podcast, everybody's lying to a certain extent during the job interview process, aren't they? The employer and the candidate. I mean, let's just be honest with ourselves for this podcast. You know it. Everybody's lying just a little bit. Or maybe you're just not fully disclosing everything, right? If you're the candidate, you're not telling them every single mistake or every single weakness you really had, are you? I mean, no. You're not telling them why you really left that last job because you hated your boss, right? Uh, Or whatever. You're not giving them everything because you want to be positive, right? If you're the employer, you're not really telling the candidate that you uh, are a little tight on cash flow or uh, that the coffee sucks in the break room or whatever, right? I mean, you're not telling them everything, are you? So everybody's lying just a little bit. Now, what's my point of the podcast? I think often people get caught up and there's way too much energy spent trying to figure out where somebody's lying, right? Now, If it's a big lie, like, for example, if you said you worked on spaceships for NASA, okay, and you didn't actually work there, (laughs) that's, you know, obviously that's a different thing. But but the little stuff, like, there's just way too much energy trying to figure that out, okay? That's not what really matters in the job interview as far as I'm concerned because I think 85%, probably 85%, you can look this up, 85% of the time people are lying on their resume or during the job interview, and that goes for employers and candidates. So... I think a lot of energy is wasted trying to figure those things out. Focus on the culture and the personality fit. That's what really matters. If you're the candidate, you're trying to figure out, does the office feel right? Does the energy feel good? Is it a good vibe? Does the culture seem to match your style? Is the person interviewing you? Do they seem like a good person? And do you want to be around them? And do you think they could mentor you and and help develop your career? Things like that. Does the company have a future? Does the does the product have legs? Does it look like things are, are, you know, super bright for the company in the future? That's what matters. And if you're the employer, you're looking at the candidate saying, does Johnny fit my team? Okay, does he fit the company culture? Do you Do you like his style? Is there good chemistry between you and him? Those are the things that matter. And so often I, I hear people get caught up in, in little debates like, well, Johnny put that he left his last company in November and really he didn't leave until December 2nd. You know, move past that. Okay, that, that stuff really just doesn't matter as far as I'm concerned. Focus on the big picture, personality to company culture, and you'll be a lot better off. And there is your Rider Flex tip of the day. We truly hope you find our material helpful and entertaining. And while our podcast can be heard across most platforms, including iTunes, Google Play, Spotify, YouTube, and SoundCloud, you can become a supporter of this podcast by visiting our show on the platform Anchor FM. That's anchor.fm slash riderflex. You can also send us your questions or suggested topics for future episodes to the email address podcast at riderflex.com or drop us a voicemail at 888-964-5876 extension 710. Visit riderflex.com to learn more about us. Thanks so much for listening, folks, and have a great day.